Hey, what's up you guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get my everyday makeup look. I wear this just on an everyday basis. So, I am not naked, I promise. Um, I'm going to be taking the double wear foundation in 1 in 1 and 2 in 1 mixed together because I'm in between shades. I'm going to mix those together and dot it all over my face. And then I'm going to blend it in with my beauty blender and my beauty blender is dampened. Then I'm taking my Double Wear Concealer by Estee Lauder in the shade Light and putting that under my eyes. And then I'm going to be blending that out with my Beauty Blender. And then of course I'm doing the same thing to the other eye. Then I'm going to be taking the concealer and just dotting up my chin, my cupid's bow, my nose, and my forehead just to kind of brighten those areas up so that it matches my under eye. And then of course blending it out with my beauty blender. Then I'm be taking my Makeup Forever HD powder and translucent and setting my under eye with that with my beauty blender. This is just going to make sure it does not crease throughout the day. Then I'm going to be taking my Anastasia Brow Wiz in soft brown, I believe. And then I'm just going to be putting that in my eyebrows. I am going to be using the spoolie in to brush them out first. And then I just fill those in. I don't really do anything crazy with them. I just follow the natural shape of my brow. And of course, the same to the other. Then I'm going to be taking the spoolie side to blend it through to make sure there's no harsh lines. Then I'm taking that same powder and setting my foundation. And this is a Real Techniques powder brush. Then I'm going to be using the uh, uh, Milani Luminoso blush. And I'm going to be putting that on the apples of my cheeks. And this is like a cheap Soho um, powder brush, I think, from like Walmart or something. Then I'm going to be taking my Becca highlighter in the Shane shade Moonstone and I'm going to be putting that on the high points of my cheeks and my nose. And then above the eyebrows and the Cupid's bow. And 
Then I'm going to be taking my NYX Matte Liquid Liner and I'm going to be putting that on my eyes. Filming and doing liquid eyeliner is not easy. <laughs> but I'm just going to keep that close to the lash line. And please excuse my crappy filming right here. I'm totally in the way with my hands. Then I'm going to take my Sumptuous Infinite Mascara and the Sumptuous Knockout Mascara by Estee Lauder and I'm going to layer those on top of each other. I really like the way this turns out. It really makes my eyelashes long and thick, which helps because I have tiny blonde eyelashes. And I go in with the Sumptuous Infinite first, and then I go with Sumptuous Knockout afterwards. And then of course, just going on my lower lash line with the Sumptuous Knockout. Then I'm going to be taking this lip color, which was a total mistake. <laughs> I accidentally grabbed a color that was way too dark. So then I'm going in with this color by Tarte. It's one of the, um, I believe it's called Lip Surgeon Pencils. I love these because they're so easy to use. It's like a crayon. I'm going to be taking my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray and setting my face with this. It's going to make this makeup last all day. I'm going to fan it out. All right, you guys, that is the finished makeup look. This is just something I wear every day to work. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.